The name Jiok Hoje means a house resembling a red tiger in Korean, recently replaced the old building on this site. The family, having lived there for a long time, understood the site well and desired a home that suited their experiences and preferences. The site, located in a corner of a district with similar house shapes, had three sides connected to a ramp and a 4.9 meter height difference between its west and east sides. During the planning stage, the family aimed for a larger scale than neighboring buildings, initially considering a two-story design but ultimately adding a third floor. District code requirements, including a sloping roof and a privacy fence, increased the house's volume. To harmonize with the district's brick-based architecture, the developer divided the house into segmented volumes and roofs, solving the size issue. A quick announcement. If you find this video insightful, do support us and join our community of home enthusiasts alike. It will be reinvested to better research and videos. Now, back to the tour. The architecture featured sloped roofs, concrete slabs, and bricks in three different patterns. Inspired by common red brick houses in Korea, the design blended standard elements from Korea and abroad, creatively incorporating traditional and modern motifs. For instance, a pillar with a traditional Korean door motif was divided into four vertical pieces and iron bands. Elements from architects like Mies van der Rohe and Carlo Scopa added a unique touch. Prioritizing visual openness and privacy coexistence, the first floor had flexible family spaces that opened to the garden, while the second floor, dedicated to private spaces, minimized windows. Individual terraces provided outdoor access for each room, and courtyards allowed ventilation and light without compromising privacy. The interior emphasized openness and connections between floors, with void spaces and courtyards linking different levels. Doors designed to break boundaries contributed to the sense of openness. Jiok Hoje successfully blended familiar and opposing elements, creating harmony with the surroundings, satisfying privacy needs, and offering a fresh reinterpretation of familiar materials. The design balanced individual and public considerations, resulting in a satisfying and harmonious work. We will now do the rest of the tour. Sit back and enjoy. Site drawings at the end. Thanks for staying till the end, if you find this video helpful in any way, please feel free to like and subscribe.